and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Doomsday Challenge. We are here with the family and we have a little bit of a disaster going about to happen. Paparazzi left so I brought the whole family outside to eat because they were all starving and now another paparazzi has showed up and we might be in a bit of a pickle. I don't know what's going to happen, and she's going to walk right over by them. So, everyone's going to have to be rolled for. Ugh. Um, that is really annoying. So, before you even go inside, and before we even work on this, I'm going to go ahead and um, um, ignore this call that you're getting, because I don't care. And I'm going to quickly go ahead and roll, and I know that I've got the game paused, but it's not going to take me that long, because I've already got the page pulled up on my phone so it is t12 threshold 11 right now so for millie she gets a two so that means that she gets sick um and she rolls a six but with her 10 athletic she does not get sick enough to the point where she can't go back inside because she lives um then for mason he gets a 7, which means he gets sick, and a 3, but with his 8, is it 8? 9, um, he gets a 12. Ooh. I think it's 12 or below he dies. Uh-oh. <gasps> I think we're gonna lose Mason. Oh, no. It's three days away. Oh, no. Um... Yeah, so I think it's 12 or below he dies. I'm going to go back and look, but I think Mason's going to die, unfortunately. Um, The girls, this is kind of scaring me now. It's a roll for Timberly. Um, she gets a 12. She had to get above an 11, so she doesn't even get sick. And for Monica, she gets a 6, so she gets sick. If I roll again, she gets a two. <gasps> no, Monica's gonna die. Oh no, Monica definitely dies because she only gets up to an eight. So it looks like we might be losing father and daughter. Oh my god, I feel so bad. Like, oh my god. And they just got remarried. And Monica's so pretty. Like, I was so excited to see her as a young adult. Oh, she's one of my favorite characters on this. And we're going to lose her and Mason. Oh, no. Stupid paparazzi. <sighs> so, um, Millie can go back inside. Um, I'm going to let her just go to sleep. And Timberly will be okay to go back inside. Um, unfortunately, we're going to be losing Mason and Monica. I do want to save a copy of them. I'll have them as ghosts, though, so we could bring them back after this. No, we won't. We won't bring them back. But, man, that really sucks because she had it going for her, too. Hmm, that's sad. Alright, well, here's what's going to happen. So, because we have to do this, I'm going to have them go inside, and I know that they're infected and all, but I'm going to do it so that they don't go outside when we kill them off. The Grim Reaper will come inside instead of going outside to take their lives, because this is going to be really sad really quick. Alright guys, so say goodbye to Mason and Monica, because their time on this LP has come to an end. Unfortunately, I have to go ahead and kill them off because they didn't make it through. Mason, I'm pretty sure if I'm right when I say that... Oh, how it goes is it is the number and below, and since he had 9 and 3, that ends up being 12. And you had to get above a 12, so you had to at least have a 13, and he didn't quite make it. So, unfortunately, we're going to have to go ahead and kill him off. I am so sad to do this. Like, it breaks my heart. Guys. <laughs> I don't want to kill my sims, though. <laughs> you guys are probably, like, laughing because I'm, like, having a heart attack. I'm trying to, like, even just find, like, the kill thing. I don't even see it. 
What is under? Mm -hmm. Worst kill. Oh. Yeah. Um. I'm just gonna do. Let's see. Let's do. Invisible sin. Let's do. Um. Um, I'm trying to think, like, sickness, um, let's do starvation, maybe the mummy's curse, uh, um, plenty of forest trauma, um, let's do, let's just do, Yeah, let's just do starvation. Oh man, this is so sad. He died of hunger. It's so sad to see neighbors. Oh. It's been added to the mausoleum. Okay, so I'm going to have to go grab those. Oh, I'm so sad to see Monica go because I love her. <sighs> I can always, like. <coughs> Um, I don't have a saved copy of her, so what I'm going to do, and I know this may sound kind of cheaty, but I might want to play with her again because I really love her and I want to see what she looks like as a young adult, and since she won't be aging up to a young adult in this LP, I'm going to save her to my bin so before so. I kill her off, um, just because that's the kind of person I am, and then, um, I'm just gonna go back out, because I love her looks, like, she is, like, one of my favorite sims I've ever created on The Sims 3, and she is so cute, and, like, I love her, and now I have to kill her off, and I feel really bad, um, I didn't realize that they didn't actually get the urns, so I don't really know how we're gonna get them, Enros, Master Controller, Advanced, Oh, this is so sad. <gasps> what about all the food that was in his inventory? <gasps> oh, no. We have no food. <laughs> Horse kill. Yes. We're going to do starvation as well. Oh, my God. I'm down to three sims, guys. Um, Can I edit the mausoleum from here? Like, is this a possibility? Um, no, really? Uh, manage the dead. I'm gonna have her come over here and manage- Oh, God. I want her to come over here and manage the dead. Oh, God, there's so many people here. Why have you got the freaking cemetery creeps? Alright, um, here's the thing. We didn't get any of the stuff from their inventory. Oh. I'm kind of freaking out, like, seriously freaking out, because I really, I really, oh my god, we lost the soccer ball, oh my god, we lost the soccer ball, oh no, we lost our soccer ball, okay, okay, it's okay, we can do this, we can still do this, um, uh, okay, is there anyone still at the house? Because I don't... Is the paparazzi still here? Yeah. Um, this is this is terrifying. She had honey. Okay, give him some honey because he is very hungry. So go ahead and let him drink that. Oh my god, I can't believe I lost my soccer ball. What else did I lose? What else did I lose? Oh my god, I'm so sad. Let's look at the family tree. This is so sad. They died. Oh. And it was only with three days left. Like, they've made it so far in life. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go ahead and unlock this, just 
for the first person who uses it. Um, and she can't manage the dead if there's people there, so we can't even leave the house anymore. Like, we can't. That was too close to call. We just lost two people in this episode. That's so crazy. They've been so fine up until this moment. And now I don't even have a soccer ball to work on. So what am I going to freaking work on? Oh my god, that's so annoying. I guess just practice your speech for right now, buddy. I don't know what to tell you. We'll have to go get more honey tonight, tonight when she leaves or something. Oh my god, I'm so upset with myself. Like, oh my gosh. One stupid action to eat, like, caused me half of my family. Oh my god. Why me? Why? It was three days! There was all that shit happened! I'm so upset about this. Like, seriously. Alright. Go outside and get the mail. Do we have any more celebrities? She's a celebrity. Crap. Alright, well. Come outside, grab the mail. I'm gonna have you run back here when you're done. You're gonna have to take over for your papa bear, buddy. Like, you're just gonna have to. I'm gonna keep her reward certificate. It's the only thing she's actually, that's actually went okay. Oh my god, I'm so upset that this happened. Okay. Smoke the box and harvest the honey. Do the same thing here. Smoke the box, harvest the honey. Oh my god, I thought the person was going to die. Uh, should not appear in game. What? Script error. Gabriel Woodard should not appear in game. Okay, I don't really know what you're trying to tell me, buddy. I don't. If the person's not to be in the game, then delete them. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Okay, I need to watch him, but I need to watch them as well. They're just sleeping. And I already rolled for this sickness, so it's that's not something we have to worry about either. Alright, well this is going to be a little bit better because they'll have some food. And then I want you to go over here. Oh no. Okay, they're going the other way. Go ahead and catch this bug. These people make me nervous. They make me really nervous. Ugh. Actually, he's probably going to run the wrong way. So I'm going to have him go here by running. Okay, she's getting up. Um, the problem is she doesn't have any honey. So let's take some of his and give it to her. We'll let her drink that. Good drink. Alright, I'm going to have you run over here and you're going to catch this. And they're still playing, like, football down there. So I don't really know. Alright. And I'm going to get you to go here by running. And she's using the bathroom, so when she's done, I will lock it for the night. Come on, buddy. Run inside. We ain't got time for this. Okay, we are going to let you light the fire, because I know you're really hungry. I think she's okay, and she's okay, because they were already outside. I'm going to try and let him light the fire and work on it. Oh, we've got two days of being heartbroken. Alright, go here. Alright, go ahead and roast up some beeswax. Oh, please not here. Please not here. Goodness. Oh, God. There's so much traffic on this road. I really hate this road. Like, I just want to stab someone already. Oh, my God. I can't believe we lost our people. Like, seriously. I'm so upset about this. With three days left, too. That's, like, the worst part. It's so close to the end, and now she's heartbroken. Oh, a rebound kiss. Whoa, girl. Whoa. All right, ask about her day. Is she not upset? Is she the only one that's upset? Like, he lost his father, and he lost his sister, and he's not even upset. So it's weird, because, like, she's upset, but he's not. It's really awkward. Anyways. Go here by running. I guess I'm only going to send one person out at a time from now on. Oh, 
so sad. She is so, so, so upset. Okay. Um, ask if Sim slept well. Uh, let's see. For a high five. Okay, everyone's back inside. Do Shaka Bra. Buddy, I don't know what's going on with your phone, but ignore it. Uh, play your guitar in France. <coughs> I'm gonna say no, because we're not gonna be going to France when we live here. This is not gonna matter. And did I lock this for everybody? Lock for everybody. Oh, I just heard somebody. Oh, they're just running by. Never mind. Joke's on us. Uh, the bad thing is we don't have anything for anyone to work on now. Except for talking to people. So, here we go. It's gonna be a great time, folks. Um, gossip. I'm just gonna try and make these guys friends. Ask her about her age. <laughs> Isn't it a shame? Yeah, it's terrible. Like, should have never happened. Why would you guys be like, you totally didn't need to kill them off? Like, you're so wrong. What are you doing, you stupid idiot? The second time you've made this mistake. But I'm pretty sure I calculated in the athletic skills with it, and it didn't work out. Here's I am 60 days younger than you. Holy bejesus. <laughs> She's like wrecking it. I guess it kind of makes sense since they age up on the same day, which is, I think is kind of odd. But I guess kind of makes sense. All right, compliment her cleverness. At least they're becoming friends. Chat with her. Um. Uh, why don't you take a photo together? I really don't know what to have him do, so I guess we could just have him sleep. I mean, that's pretty much what we're going to be spending our time doing is sleeping. We don't have anything better to do. Oh, whoa. Alright. I'm going to have you... Um... Fry on her shoulder. You can... Um, ask about her day. Mm -hmm. Uh, give her a high five. <laughs> um, Shaka Bra. Uh, tell her a story. Um, compliment her. I hear people. Uh, tell her dramatic story. Talk about sculpting. Let's make sure this went down. Yep, it did. So tomorrow in the game is actually going to be the last day that the challenge is happening. Mario Sledge is getting pretty old. Okay. Somebody else pass on. That's great. Let's do um special uh jock. Uh no. Ask if Sim slept well. We don't really have like a lot of great interactions with her. Let's talk about your many accomplishments. I don't think that's gonna be a good one, but we'll try it. And request a compliment. And we will talk about sculpting. Give her a high five. Mm. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to be a good one. Okay, is there anyone down there now? There might not be, but there's somebody at our front door now. Alright, well, what I'm going to do is, when they're done talking, I'm going to let them go to sleep. She actually wants to become friends with her, that's kind of nice. I'm going to let them go to sleep so that time picks up. Look at the sky, it's so pretty here. Like, I like this world for the sky and stuff. And I like how different the rabbit holes are. 
but I don't know. It's kind of weird, like in the summertime when it's like yellow grounds. Like, who has yellow grounds? That's not norm. No, oh, just kidding. Up for yourself. I'm gonna go down here and see if we can come down and grab the things. It looks like we can, so let's go ahead and manage the dead real quick while I'm thinking about it, because if I forget to do this before we leave this town, I will be very angry with myself. So, we're gonna quickly do this, go manage the dead, and then I'm gonna have her go here. No, go manage the dead. Please. Come on. Lord? I'm not considering this close contact because there's nothing I could do to make it any different. So I'm not considering close contact. By the way, you guys are like, she's got in a taxi cab and like, there's toast my goat, somebody in that cab, like driving it. I don't care. Like, I don't care. And that person, whoever's haunting that, just stay right over there. Keep haunting Belagos. Don't come over to my house. Welcome to my house. Baby, take control now. Oh, why has Millie got one? Wait, what? <laughs> that was weird. Uh, I'm looking for Monica. Shouldn't she have been at the top? No? Okay. Mm. Mason. Did I take someone else? Mason Matheson, Millie Matheson. These are not us, I don't think. Monica. Millie. Those from say. I'm keeping this Mason and this Monica. Alright, go home. Go home. Is she, like, absent-minded or something? Because she keeps forgetting what she's supposed to... Yeah, she is. Okay. Alright, let's get you back home. Now that we've got her back home, um, I'm gonna let her make something to eat since there's nobody here. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, let me go ahead and let you light the fire. I know. I know. We're going to put their gravestones right here. Um, he is not hungry. He just needs the bathroom. He's going to pee himself. There's nothing I can do to help him. All right. So we are going to go ahead and let you roast up the lynx. And um, while you're working on it, you can't tend to the garden because your mood is too low. We are going to lock this to everyone but myself. And once he pees himself, he should be good enough to go. Alright, go tend the garden. Please. Oh. I can't believe we lost two of our sims on, like, the last few days. I seriously can't believe that that happened. Mood is too low. Well then, why don't you come uh, get some this beeswax in you, and then hopefully that'll get you in a good enough mood. And hopefully no one comes over here while you guys are outside. I'm going to have Billy get back inside. Never run inside. Keep at least some of them safe, because we've got we've to gotta, gotta definitely complete this challenge. I can't lose all of my sins. That would be ridiculous. Once she runs inside, uh, we'll have her mop up that puddle. And when she gets up, I'm gonna have her roll some beeswax quickly as well. And let's get you to mop up that puddle. Come on, you could do it. All right, once you're done, go ahead and tend the garden. And I think since she's the one who's mourning the most, I'm going to let her take the bath. 
And I think she got the bath yesterday, but she's still mourning. Actually, I would like you to actually come out here and mourn this. You're just brokenhearted from witnessing the death of your man. I don't think you're sad about your daughter. That is so sad to say. Because you should be sad more about your kid than your husband. I mean, you should be equally sad. Let me put it this way. But she is defo sad about the broken heart. And I think that's from, like, a loved one, more or less. All right. Well, at least it lessened it a little bit. All right. I'm going to actually let her go to sleep because she's actually tired. And I'm going to let... I'm going to let Timberly um, go ahead and... Instead of eating, she is going to go use uh, the bathroom. And then when she's done, she can eat some beeswax. Okay. So, it's a pretty crazy, hectic world now. I don't really know... I don't really know what to do with them. He's working on the garden. Okay. Well, he's actually done working on the garden. So, I'm going to let him come on in here and practice his speech. I don't really know what else to have him do. Like I said, we're just a couple of days away now. We're just two days away from... Well, yeah, two days away. Bible this day is more than half over, pretty much, though. So, really, we're like a day and a half away from the end of this challenge. <sighs> because, like I said, once it hits midnight on the last day, when it's supposedly going to be their birthday... Um now that it's just the two birthdays instead of four. Um, that'll be when I read the last event. And that'll be the end of the challenge. Um, and then I'll probably move them at some point and give you like a update of where they moved to or whatever. But otherwise, that's that's pretty much it. I need to do the update for Black Widow. Um, not Black Widow. Uh, Hunger Games. I need to do update on that. I've got the update ready. I just gotta do it. Alright, keep going. Do it until this improves. And she's just having a grand old time. No one's still outside, so she should still be okay. Watch her get outside and somebody show up. I'm gonna be so angry. I really will. I will be so angry. <clears throat> anyone driving here. Uh, go ahead and light the fire. What does it say? Alright, he's reached the maximum. Okay. Let's go ahead and roast up a beeswax. I'm gonna get you to come outside. You are going to catch this. And then I'm going to have you go here by running. Maybe catch these. No, I didn't mean to click that. I meant to... Nope, didn't mean to clean box either. Uh, let's go ahead and smoke the box. Harvest the honey. Smoke the box. Harvest the honey. <clears throat> when she's done... I'm going to get her to go here by running. Alright, and when he's done, I'm going to have him go here by running. sell this hedgehog. It's worth a lot of money. Alright, she's back inside. Mm. <coughs> Alright, so since the only thing we can really have her do... Alright, let's get you to go here by running. Let's get you to practice your speech. 
and I'm gonna get you to go here by running. That gets us some food, which is great. All right, well, that seems to be my timer. Um, so how many more days do I think this is gonna take? The next episode, I am going to probably do until the end. So it'll be the rest of today, um, all of tomorrow, and then that'll be the end of the episode. So I'm not going to like um, set a timer. I will set a timer just to see kind of how long it takes me because I don't want it to be extremely long. That's why I'm kind of trying to fast forward as well a little bit here and there. So if you guys are wondering. Anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. In the description below, there is a donation link if you'd like to donate to the channel. Oh, excuse me, along with things like my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Twitch link. So if you'd like to check us out, please feel free. And I will talk to you guys in my next and final episode of Doomsday Challenge. I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching.